This ride is really exciting for me. Which place is this? My rear is gone. Pondicherry. Ah, oh, it's such a nice uh, Saturday morning and totally. It was at this moment that he knew. He. F <laughs> that was scary with the dog. Anyways, uh, such a nice Saturday morning, and we are off. We are on our first ride this year, New Year. So. This was absolutely not planned and uh, we are heading towards Hosu Road. We have not uh, decided on the destination properly yet, but we have something in mind. Road is there, Rodilva? ಹೈವೆ <laughs> This ride is really exciting for me uh, because we didn't plan anything. Last night, uh, last night uh, my cousin Lalit who is going in the front on his Continental GT, uh, he messaged me at around 10 o'clock and he said let's go for a short ride. And uh, short ride is for me, every weekend I used to come to Shulgiri, this is the shortest ride that I can plan when I don't have time. But uh, later we decided to go on a two day ride, that's today and tomorrow, Saturday and Sunday. It's 16th of Jan and uh, we just, we didn't have any place in mind as such. So we thought of riding for about 200 to 300 kilometers approximately and stay somewhere and get back. So we took Hosur Road and uh, uh, we don't know where we are going to stay. Uh, we have a couple of places in mind. Let's see, we'll, we'll uh, uh, choose the best one for us. The idea is to not get strained and uh, we'll go to some destination, uh, spend some good time together and we'll get back. We started off at around uh, 5.45 from my place and uh, right now we have reached uh, Shulgiri. We just wanted to refuel and uh, get going. We had a couple of biscuits and a tea. So we should be good for another one, one and a half hour. We're not hungry as of now. See, such rides are really exciting. And uh, I'm not I'm not used to, uh, you know, go on a ride without any plan. But this is the first time. Hope everything goes fine and we'll enjoy the ride. Actually, Lalit was wearing that backpack on his back. So, for riding for about 5 to 6 hours, and he's not used to carrying luggage on his back. So, we somehow managed to put the back strap under the seat and we have tied it. So, it looks secure for now. paused for a minute uh, we are not sure of the route there is one left which we need to take uh, in about a kilometer or so but there is no board which says take left to Pondicherry here come on there should be one sign board at least all I can see is Salem Coimbatore but where is uh, Pondica board Bye. 
actually we have lost the route uh, no regrets but the road that we are taking is really good it's full of nature full of greenery lots and lots of paddy fields and uh, farmhouses over here so in the next uh, 5 6 kilometers we'll be touching the highway actually we did one mistake <laughs> number one uh, we didn't uh, turn on the navigation number two we knew that uh, near krishnagiri we need to take a left turn but we we passed krishnagiri and then looked at the maps so look at this beauty on the right oh god amazing yeah. so so damn good um, so we passed uh, krishnagiri and then we looked at the maps the maps told uh, we'll have to go for another 10 kilometers ahead and then take a left so after 10 kilometers we spoke to the local people over there they said uh, sir you have come 20 kilometers ahead so we have to go back or uh, take the next left and you'll get to villages like this and in the next 15 kilometers or so we'll be uh, touching the highway so we've already come in for about 10 kilometers now five six kilometers left to touch the highway not pondicherry Finally, we saw Pondicherry signboard. It's about 184 kilometers still. Yeah, we missed our route and 20-30 kilometers is gone somewhere. But still, we enjoyed it. But now we have more confidence to, uh, you know, cruise on this road because we saw Pondicherry board. It said 184 kilometers on this road. So this is the first board we saw since we left Bangalore, which said uh, Pondicherry. <laughs> the only thing uh, I'm missing right now is speaking over uh, Sena. Um, Lalit is here to get one. He'll get it soon. Once he starts <laughs> riding with us, he'll, he'll definitely get it. It's already 9.15 uh, and uh, we didn't stop for breakfast. I'm not hungry right now. We had uh, biscuits and had tea. Let's see if we hit some uh, town, village or some place where we see a restaurant. We'll stop and have something. Right now no mood to eat. The mood is to ride. Ride, ride, ride. After riding for one or two hours, couple of hours, we get into this uh, ride trance where you just forget everything and you you will go into your subconscious and uh, you just keep riding nothing else comes to your mind it's not that your focus is gone your focus is 100% after doing that uh, village roads we came to a somewhat highway road and this is the condition of it we have come about 5-6 kilometers on this road and it's so patchy and bumpy which place is this all the store has their address in tamil only not even one store with uh, the address in english hi appa Beautiful scenery. Road is so bad. It's been about half an hour. The road is getting worse. Uh, when will this get better here? Scenery is not getting better, but uh, we are getting some uh, scenic views. At least the eyes are enjoying. <laughs> but my body and my rear is gone. If you, if you have done Pondicherry and if this is not the route that we are supposed to take, please, please
please let me know in the comments below those village roads were so much better here these roads are gone so the good roads are back uh, for the past 15 to 20 kilometers the roads are like this it's not the best road but it's good it's a uh, it's, it's good it's manageable Pondicherry. Pondicherry. Straight road. Uh -huh. Thank you. Uh -huh. That road is not a good road. It's not a good road. It's not a good road. Ready? Trivandrum 98. Where is Pondicherry Port? Trivandrum right 38. Velo Chennai Chain Temple. <laughs> Where is Pondicherry signboard? Where is Pondicherry signboard? Okay, we have reached Shengam. We are about 100 kilometers away from Pondi. Right now, this place is called Tirvanna Malay. It's, it's a very famous uh, place for the temple here. So, we are passing this place right now. I didn't know that the routes will be like complicated like this. <laughs> or did we complicate it? God knows here. Okay, this looks to be like a proper highway under construction yet. So we are about 40 kilometers away from uh, Pondi and one incident happened. Just a couple of minutes back, Lalit and me uh, stopped uh, for a small break. He wanted to refuel, and uh, and uh, okay, the well, good thing is that a couple of people came and met us, and they took some photos and all. So uh, near the petrol bunk, there was one guy standing, uh, like 50 meters away from the petrol bunk, and he warned us, saying that uh, you know. Uh, they are mixing kerosene and petrol, so it's not it's not good to you know refuel at this uh, petrol bunk. So Lalit went halfway in and he came back. I, I called him back. He came back. Then the owner of that bunk came, and he was literally harassing that guy. He held him, and he was taking him inside to the petrol bunk. And they were questioning us, saying, uh, "Did he tell anything about kerosene?" And all? I said, "No." He helped me. Why should I? Why should I? You know, uh, put him into trouble. So I said no. And uh, in, in, a, in a minute or two, I think they warned him and they left him. And that guy was shit scared. <laughs> Such a beautiful playground here. Yeah.